Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are rambunctious. So today I went to the local store, you know, the store, am I American? The local shops. I got one of these. Yes, that way around. Match attacks. And the reason why I want to talk about this is because we all as a kid have bought f***ing hundreds of these. Let's be honest. We bought hundreds. Like, today's a bit more of a serious video on how match attacks start you off gambling at a young age. But let's be honest, you, you never buy one of these. I've bought one, for instance. But when you go to the shops, you buy packs of these. Or even when I was younger, I used to buy the whole box. I used to ask the shopkeeper, as you say, um, for the whole box. And this was a pound. For a whole box, it's like, I don't know what it is. Like 50 quid or something, uh, 30 quid. You don't get what you want from one. For you to get an actual shiny card or the exact one you want, a very good card, you keep spending and spending cash. You, you splash cash like it's nothing. Like this was this was the most trendiest thing in your school. If you were in your school, yeah, in primary school, whatever school you went to, if you had 100 club pet eject, yeah, oh my God. Un unreal. If you, you'd have the whole sticker book as well. Not sti you'd have the whole book where you put all of these in. And if you had that filled, you are the you are the leader of the whole school. You make everyone your bitch. Like people have to bow down to you for food. It might be a bit extreme there how I'm saying it, but it's it's fucking true. You you'd have different styles of these. You'd have different season. Each season you have teams that have just been promoted to the Premier League and teams that have relegated. The way that it's a sh it's shiny already. They're trying to tell us in our minds that there's gonna be a shiny in here. If for instance, we're gonna open this packet now. The feeling of opening it is so luxur lux luxurious that they make us want to buy more and more. And these, I, I, can't, I couldn't actually believe they're still doing these. And they've changed over a year a lot, but they usually, oh my God. Wow. Jesus Christ, I've got some good players. Um, Jeez. I mean, back in the day, my, the luck one this good. Maybe they improved it. But I feel like not that many people buy these anymore. I've got to say that. But so far in the pack, we've got, so the first one, we've got shiny Marcus Alonso. Oh, that's very good. 100 defence. Oh, what do you mean? Then we've got the Manchester City club badge and it's a shiny. So this is the collectibles. So when you get stuff like this, you, you want to collect them. You want to get you want to get Man United. You want to get Leeds. That makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? Because they're in the championship. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen this. But look, this is obviously with technology nowadays. Free digital packet. And I'm guessing you scan the back of this. And you get a free digital packet, so they're encouraging you to download the app and purchase more of them. Pedro, Matt Ritchie, Begovic, Yarmolenko, sort of a shiny Alex McCarthy. And I said, with these, the smell on them, that the, the smell on these, you can never have that smell with anything else. The smell. Ah. Oh. Well, that's a bit weird. I mean, I guess I'd, I'm not sure if we all do that. Like, let me know if you used to do that. But the feeling of these cards having them, you feel like, oh, you want more. You want to compete with your friends. And that gets you into the addiction in your head that you're going to start gambling. Gambling has been a concept that's been around for many, many years. From casinos to now scratch cards, lottery cards. The idea behind it is that the company that designed these, they want you to buy more and more. And it gives you that feeling of even though you've taken an L on one of them, essentially, and you haven't won anything, you still have potential to winning something and you have the feeling that you need to win something. It's very rare where people buy one of something or they have one go on the slot machine. They're usually gambling and gambling till all their money's gone. And that's what these big companies want us to do. So I was in my loft the other day, or if you're American or anywhere else in the fucking country, you call it attic, which makes no sense because isn't that some basement? I don't know, but it's fucked. Like Everyone else that is not in England, your language is... Is messed up. Now I'm not sure why I actually kept these. Probably just to reminisce or something. I don't know. But these were my old, back in the day. I sound like an old man. Match of that book. Like look at that collector collector binder. It's called bloody binder. I mean, I had look at this. I had these packed full with every. I've literally got I've, the whole thing is full. The whole thing is full. Imagine how much money. Because I wouldn't buy the amount of packs that are in this if you times it by how many there are. I would have to spend so many to even get one page. The 100 clubs, I've literally got every single page full. Petter check, what do you mean? If you have Cristiano Ronaldo, yeah? If you had, do you know what? If you have Cristiano Ronaldo, 101 defense, core, 101 attack, yeah? You are leaving that school, you're graduated to, to university already if you have that. Prime Minister of the school, of the country even, when you have that card. But that's just one book. I'm not sure if anyone else's addiction was it was this, but we would all, like, all the kids would bring these to school and, like, just show them off. 
This is another one. When was this back in? 2009 to 2010. Another book full with goods. Just It's just filled with everything. Managers even. I mean, look at Rafa Benita, the morbidly obese bitch. We have all sorts, man of the match. I mean, there's, there's that, I'm surprised how many I have. Here. And then that would lead you on to each World Cup. Germany 2006, getting all the stickers. Oh my God, like, I don't know if I, I, I need, you need help at this point. If you're doing this, you need to stop and think, why are you doing this? Are you doing this to impress people? Or what are you doing it for? Because it doesn't do anything. It just sort of sits there and does nothing. Or I guess people are trying to do it to like show authority in their schools or between their friends. Oh, I have Cristiano Ronaldo, shut up. I mean, there's, there's, there's so many more we have that, I mean, look, your, my squad, like, remember this, I don't have any in there, but Jesus Christ. Then I've just got loads of random ones here, like, there's so many. My point is that they psychologically don't think about us, they want it, us to implant in our heads. We have to keep buying these products, they're thinking. They know in our head that once we buy one or two, it's going to be an addiction, but we keep buying it. A good example is my brother, as soon as he turned 18, which was last year now, he straight away started getting on, the, it wasn't an addiction, I would say, more of like, getting on the thing or buying scratch cards, lottery tickets, and that's just because you think you're 18, so you're obliged to just buy them. And if you've noticed, there's been a lot of cases of celebrity, mainstream celebrities, and people with a lot of, lot of money, very wealthy people going to Vegas, gambling a lot of their money, because they think that it's gonna be an investment, when it's not really an investment. If it was an investment, you'd put that into something like property or something. And the people at the top of the casino are probably laughing, the amount of millions they make, probably billions. There's also something a little bit like creepy or scary about it the fact that like even though people know this they still do it they still think okay i'm gonna buy one more i could win i could win i could get this this has been a bit more of a different video today thank you for watching let me know down below what you thought hit the like button subscribe and in a bit